Assalamualaikum and good morning to all lecturer and our beloved panel, Dr. Jeffrey bin Abdul Razak. My name is Hasnan Hakim bin Hassan from Diploma Manufacturing Engineering Session 2021. And today I will like to present the overview of our project, which is a portable microwave. So here I will show you the slide for my presentation project for subject code DMFD 2822 which is a diploma project one so this is my project title which is a portable microwave next but before that let me introduce to you my supervisor of this project Dr. Fairol Azmi Ben Jafar that have helped me a lot during this report project diploma one in this semester also my partner member for this project Muhammad Hazmi Ben Muhammad Helmi This is the table of content my presentation. I have this re representation sequently from number 1 to number 7. This presentation is covered by introduction by where I will explain about what is the microwave work. Number 2, problem statement where I will describe the issue that have been experienced. Number 3, objective and scope that I will explain the project name and the methodology which to determine the best plan and overview of the project. Number six, result. I will explain about the design that we have choice for the final product. Lastly, I will conclude our project. So this is all the table of content of my presentation. First introduction, as usual, we will start the content with introduction. As we know, project background microwave is an electromagnetic wave with a wavelength in the range 0 0.001 meter to 1 to 1.3 meter, shorter than that of a normal radio wave, but longer than those of infrared radiation. Microwave are used in radar, in communication, and for heating in microwave oven and in various industrial process. But in our project, we will design and fabricate a portable microwave for the hikers and campus to reduce electricity and air pollution. Next is a problem statement. According to my observation and analysis, first, we know some portable microwaves are large and heavy, so they will make it difficult for them to carry anywhere. Second, the weather conditions of our country are hot and humid. So it is a uh, quiet, difficult to light a uh, fire in the jungle. Third, some irresponsible people will leave their campsite and will cause forest fire to occur. Last, if it is a rainy day, they will go hungry because they cannot cook and eat while uh, camping in the jungle. To achieve the objective of this project, a variety of tasks must be complete. Firstly, to fabricate a portable microwave, an optimum design must be created. The design must follow the criteria of the portable size that a man capable to bring for a long-term journey. For example, the height of the case must not be taller than 300 mm, otherwise it will become a burden for a man and not as highly portable as the objective. Next, a uh, literature review. The subject is how a gas or electric stove compare with a microwave in energy efficiency. The author is a Tempe Dexter in 29. Typical. Typically, tau a microwave would be slightly more efficient at heating water than the flame on a gas stove and should use up a little less energy. The reason the microwave heat waves are focused on the liquid or food inside not on heating the air and container around it meaning that must if not all of energy generated is used to make your water ready second how does microwave work from jonathan hoshback microwave oven were life altering from the moment they began humming and heating in home of the 1970s the sprinter to the conventional oven cross-country runner microwave quick the process of cooking and reheating meals, saving time and increasing the potential from for leisure overwork. The mechanics of the microwave were from the very start mysterious. 
for the metallurgy and flowchart, we design the process of designing and fabricating of the portable microwave from the initial piece to the final piece. It shows the flowchart of the progression involved during the designing and fabrication of the portable microwave. The flowchart was created before the project begin. This is said because the flowchart provides a more efficient workflow and on the road workflow. This chapter plays uh, an important role in the development of the portable microwave. We start our project with a briefing from the coordinator for this subject, Dr. Muhammad Adi Rozi bin Abdul Manaf in week 1. Next, we discuss the title of the project with a supervisor and draft report submission to supervisor from weeks 1 to week 7. From week 9 to 13, we write a report and submit to supervisor and panel for access. After finish the report, we will present our product and Q&A session with panel. In final week, we must submit the final report for this project. These are three product sketches are uh, considered before choosing the final design project. The drawing comprised of one final design that was created using the current portable microwave design on the market in mind. The design meets the market demand for a very portable product that may be utilized by campus and hikers during outdoor activities. From the customer survey, we choose design 1 as a final design in this project. The above figure shows the portable microwave is in the cube shape. This geometry form was chosen because it will provide a better viewing angle compared to the cylindrical shape. There are a hole drill into the side walls of the casing for heating medium to enable the application of process on ventilation. The glass on the door is a quartz glass sheet will function as the user will be able to see the progress during heating up the food. This is because only this type of material can withstand any temperature of heat. The maximum size of the portable microwave for a man to carry around is 300 mm x 300 mm. The material that was proposed for this design was plywood but after proper consideration, this material breathes more disadvantages and higher probability of failure which result in the rejection of this design. The main advantage of this design is the large space that provides food occupied in the microwave. This is due to the large surface area used compared to the cylindrical shape area. Next is the design is uh, highly portable as the design have the holder for a man to carry around. Quartz glass sheet as a cover on the door can withstand the heat compared to any other glass so it is safe to use as the portable microwave is a kids friendly device. The main disadvantages of this design is the material. It is made of plywood which is uh, heavy and become a burden for a man to carry around and also depends on weather especially on the raining day which will cause the microwave to expand. The design is not attractive enough and lame to attract customer to buy it. And the conclusion is a basic overview regarding the portable microwave with the use of a portable microwave and advantage that a microwave brings to this technology. Its capability of decreasing air pollution or reduce electricity. Project background has also been explained, which is information regarding this project also throughout this chapter. The objective of this project will explain where a design and fabrication of the portable microwave must take place to provide the capability of a man to carry the portable microwave. The problem statement of this project was also explained in the presentation where the incapability to heat up the food in the area where there is no power supply and electricity. Lastly, the project scope of the project was included in the presentation to explain a little bit about the concept and the process of portable microwave. So, that's all the presentation for our product and inshallah we will produce the product in the next semester with a subject project diploma to with as much enthusiasm as possible. Thank you.